my birds of paradise, they look a little like my birds of paradise. What shall I do? Hey guys, welcome to the show. Right behind me is in the hedge. It actually is birds of paradise. Loads of beautiful plants, flowers. You can't see them because it's been infested by all these weeds. So we're going to show you how to turn this hedge of weeds into beautiful birds of paradise. I actually prepared this earlier. Come over here. Wow, Ash, how did you achieve this? So over here, we've given these beautiful birds of paradise. We're not done yet, but we're giving them love and freedom. These disgusting weeds that are behind me, they've actually twirled all the way around and they're actually suffocating these beautiful flowers, these beautiful plants. They've made them look yucky. Mm. So we're gonna turn this after, we're gonna make it look even better on today's episode. But first up, it's time to get your garden gloves because we're gonna be pulling out some weeds. And the key with weed removal is try to pull them out from the roots and it's gonna be very fun. Let's come on over. Ready for weed pulling. So this is our hedge of weeds. So let's come on in. Let's see where the birds of paradise are. Look at that. It's been completely encaptured. And look, they, they spin around. They're trying to suffocate and destroy and kill out these birds of paradise. It's very disgusting. And you're gonna be in for a shock how long these weeds are. Cause you might think, okay, you pull them out from here and they're gone and you have to do some snipping. But no, I'm gonna show you right now one of these strands. I'm just gonna grab it from the middle here. And then you start pulling. And it's like a magician's rope. You're gonna find that it comes. You grab a big bunch of them together. And you just pull. Like it's coming from here. Look, that's the root right here, right over here. That's where it is. Look at that. Disgusting. This root, let's see how long it is. It's actually the same one. Yeah. Just just that from a bit of pulling. We're starting to get some freedom. Alright, now that you've seen how it's done, you ready to do it? Yes, I cannot wait to get my hands dirty. Okay, let's get to it. It's really enjoyable. I have to say, once you get into it, you really get hooked into it. And these guys are just phenomenally long like oh look at this one okay wait wait this one was starting over here but actually if you follow it back follow it back follow it back it's actually on your turf over here and maybe if i prize it through a bit more i might find where the end point is i can't there it's quite long i love this so much fun so one thing to look out for is that the roots are usually towards the front here so if you pull out from the bottom you'll find the root straight away okay. and then but still do what you do but yeah, yeah I what you mean. that's where the root is. Yeah, it's all along the first beginning of the track. Yeah, you're right. What's tricky is that the roots are really stuck in the rocks and it does take a lot of earthing out to get them. But I think you just have to get as much as you can out. Fantastic job over here. You've gotten rid of a lot of the weeds. I'm starting to see the beautiful birds of paradise. Great job. Now something you need to do to make it awesome is check out the other side. Whoa! Just check out the weeds on this side. Holy smokes, this is pretty epic. I think we're gonna need to do some digging on this one. Yeah, so they grow on both sides and I've actually been pulling some weeds out from here. And I found that a lot of it is coming in through the grass over here. We've got a big patch of weed. So that's the problem with weed. If they grow anywhere, they'll continue to attack and they'll find whatever plants they can and suffocate them because they want all the water and the nutrients of the soil for themselves. No, so not on my turf. Okay. I've got the root at the bottom here. Right here, if you can see it. And these ones are fast growing. I'm trying to just, there you go. Pulling my fingers around it, as you can see. All right, cut. So I'm just trying to dig to get as much leverage as possible. Oh, 
Oh, there you go. Look how this is, this is just growing and growing. To be honest with you, I don't know if I got rid of it all. It was a hard one that is. I ripped out a good chunk. I can't seem to see much of it, just little bits. But I guess we'll have to keep on top of this stuff as it grows back. So let's get to work. Uh, there's another one over here. This is what it looks like. So ideally, you want to get as many strands when you find the root as possible and grab onto them because that gives you a lot of leverage. And then, oh, there you go. Just that. But when you cut them one by one, it makes it a lot harder. <laughs> Got too much. How's it going on your end? Thanks, Ash. It's going really well. I've just managed to get rid of a whole load of weeds over here and you can actually start to see the stems of the beautiful birds of paradise again and I can't wait till we get on top of it so we can trim down all of the brown bits and let them live again. But in saying that, we've got so much more left to do so we have to carry on going. Just keep doing it. Keep doing it, get rid of that crap. Never ending, isn't it? Yeah. All right, we're getting close, close to the beginning of the end and just look what these guys are up to. Look how they vined around this beautiful bird of paradise. They choked it out. It's all completely choked out. Can't breathe anymore, it's completely died. Choked it. And they choked out this one as well, look at it over here. It was nice and healthy, then it wrapped itself around it, choked it out, choked it out. So, a couple of more months and we would have been saying goodbye to these birds of paradise. So I want you to do the honors and pull out these disgusting vine weeds. You ready? Yeah. Oh, they are so strong. Ugh. It's a great way to take out all your frustrations. Don't you dare kill my birds of paradise. Don't you dare. Mwah. I see some more. You're not getting away that easily, sunshine. There's just so many. Go for this bad boy. Oh my God, look how big and strong these birds of paradise are, but no more because of this horrible, disgusting, creeping vine and voila that is it no more how dare you there you have it so let's just take a look at how much we've actually accumulated all of this is all weeds this is literally another bush going all the way around here all the way around here this is incredible and now not only that but we also have an equally the same amount on the other side come follow me look at that heap of weeds just there and I'm pleased to say that I'd say about 80% of the weeds have now gone what we're gonna do in part two is Ash is gonna help me to tidy up these birds of paradise and make them live again and be vivacious and prune them down way to compress all of your greens is actually jump inside it and jump jump jump